everyone, it's Kim here. Welcome back to my channel or welcome for the first time to my channel, Never Too Late. I'm so happy to have you here with me for this Timu haul. Um, I'm kind of going on a little bit of a tropical journey today. I got some different tropical kinds of things. Um, so I am going to do it the way I generally do and kind of show you everything. And then I'll pause and try things on and see if if they fit, they look good. If they're worth the worth the price I paid, I have to say I got some really good deals in this haul. Um, so I have a lot to show you. By the way, if you do like my videos or you think you might like to watch more of them, please um, subscribe. And if you want notifications of when my videos are coming out, you can hit the notification bell. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to let you know what the prices and the sizes that I got are um, when I show them to you first. And then um, that way, you know, you can decide if it's a good deal. And also if, you know, you think the size I got might be right or maybe gauge what you would need from that. So the first thing I have, and I have had these in other hauls in different colors, but I, I pretty much, they're so inexpensive that I think I got one almost in every color they had. This one is brown. It's just a little, it's very stretchy, little rope looking belt. It's obviously not real rope. It's plastic, but, um, or some kind of plastic like material. And then it has, um, little pearls on the ends. Very cute, very easy to wear. And that belt is 78 cents. So it's only 78 cents. It was kind of one of those one size fits all deals, but the other ones I have in different colors definitely do fit me. Um, the next thing I have, I have two of the same. They're little thin belts. I got a purple one and a green one because once again, these are so small. I mean, so inexpensive. They are one size fit all as well. And they were both 87 cents. So let me just show you, hold them up here. So they have these really cute little uh, gold buckles, kind of like a, a little bit of a brushed finish. And then they're just long. They just, they just go right into here. So buckle them like that. Very cute. Um, like I said, 87 cents. I got different colors because I just thought it would be fun to have some belts in different colors that maybe I wouldn't have thought of to throw with an outfit or, you know, I don't necessarily have, you know, a lot of accents in these colors. So I just thought it would be kind of fun to have those. So I did get those as well. The next thing I have is a set of pajamas. Um, and these were $8.49 and I did get an extra large. With pajamas, I really like pajamas to be comfortable and baggy. Um, and I do, I've, I think I've said this before, when I'm wearing, on my days when I'm working from home, I will work from home in my pajamas. I, when I'm at home and I don't have anywhere to go and I'm just going to be hanging around the house, I love pajamas. But this set was really cute. Um, it is a set with flamingos and I love flamingos. Uh, let's see, find one that's not upside down. Here we go. Look on the back. But um, yeah, it's got flamingos. I'm not sure why there are yellow flamingos, but maybe there are yellow flamingos. I don't know, I'm not an expert. Um, but it is a set. So, huh, let me get it undone. So you have the little, um, have the pants that, um, I don't know how long, let's see. They might be a little long on me because I'm only five feet tall, but there's, just the pajama pants with the elastic waist and the bottoms, nothing at the bottoms. Um, then the top, it's just a t-shirt like top. Um, very cute. And then it also came with, and I, I, maybe this was in the picture and I just didn't notice, sorry, I stepped out of frame there, but it came with a little sleep mask. Don't know that I'll actually use that, um, but it's really cute. And if that is something that you do use, it's very nice. So I'm going to try those on. Hold on a second. Dropped my prices. Um, okay, the next thing I have is a pair of shoes. And I have definitely had these shoes in different colors in my hauls before everything is falling down. <laughs> but um, I got them in this blue color. It's such a vibrant color. It's a beautiful color. And I can definitely see putting these with a lot of different things. So I'm excited to have this color kind of in my wardrobe now. So I have those. And those shoes were $3.98. 
can't beat that. $3.98 and I got a size, a size 7 because that's what I normally wear. And that's, I do have them. In fact, I have a pair of them on right now. Let's see if I can get that part up. I have um, the green pair on. I've been, I wore them to work this morning and um, home from work because I hate, I had my wedges on in the middle of the day, but I do hate driving in heels or wedges or anything. I like flat shoes to drive in. So anyway, I always had these. So I was wearing these for part of the day, but they are, um, I know, I'm pretty sure those will fit because the other ones have. But the next thing I have for you is a pair of shorts. And these are very tropical. They were $2.27. And in these I got an XXL. Um, I found with the shorts and pants bottoms, run a little I need a bigger size than I do in other things I'm not sure how these are gonna fit they are kind of oh my gosh they have a pocket I did not realize they even, I didn't even realize they had pockets so two dollars and 27 cents and pockets that's insane I just thought this was a really cute tropical print I think it would look really cute with those blue shoes maybe or also let me show you the color I have on now this color I think I could get away with this color as well not to mention just a brown sandal. I mean, I could I could pick so many different pairs of sandals to wear with this or little tennis shoes. But I just thought these were really cute, kind of tropical, and I could put a t-shirt with them. So lots of things I could do with them. I really thought they were adorable. All right, next I have a couple pairs of earrings. What did I do with my price? There they are. Um, a couple pairs of earrings that I thought kind of fit this tropical theme. So the first one, is a smaller more neutral pair um let me see if i can get them out without losing the backs which happens for those little metal stopper things which I, I always seem to lose okay so these earrings are put the little stopper on okay they're posts first of all um they were the price was a dollar 34 and they they are posts but this is what they look like a little darker leaf and then a lighter leaf. I, I think those will look very cute with those shorts with the um, the kind of tan tan in them. And then I don't think I got the, the back out of the bag for the other ones, but oops, there we go. So there's the pair. Very, very cute for a dollar, dollar 34. Very cute. Now the next ones I got are also leaves but very different these are a little bigger and they're green so these are green leaves they were dollar 16 so still just a little bit over a dollar so a great price and these are oh i did drop i dropped the little the little plastic back on that one but that's okay i do have some of those i actually bought it on timu i bought a whole little bag of them so i have extra ones but i thought these were just really adorable they're just green Kind of look like palm leaves um very cute i think those will be cute with so many different things but i love them i love them i have been really loving the jewelry i'm getting from timu i'm really enjoying just having more variety more color i'm just really having fun with with well with the jewelry and the clothes accessories i'm, I'm just having a ball um the next thing i have is a tote bag and I couldn't resist it. It was only a dollar forty-eight, so I, I can use this. Um, I thought it might be. You know, sometimes in team, you look and things seem smaller, and I, I'm not as good as I should be about actually checking the dimensions. So I thought this was going to be a little smaller, and I could use it as like a little purse. But um, it may be a little big for that. But I can definitely use it as a tote bag um, if I'm going somewhere and I need to throw some stuff in. Even um, for a reusable bag at the grocery store. So, you know, it's a pretty decent sized bag. It would be really good for taking to the beach, maybe. And just throwing some things I might want to have in there, like my sunscreen or something like that. But I just thought it was very cute with the flamingos. I, I do have a thing for flamingos. It's true. I do. Um, okay, I think I only have one more thing. No, two more things. So, I have a dress. A kind of a tropical dress and I don't know if you've watched some of my other hauls but I did have a haul where I got a really pretty kind of leafy tropical dress and it was just too small um, I haven't ordered that yet in a bigger size I it's in my cart and I'm still contemplating but I got this one I saw this one it's a very different style but I, it has like 
Birds of Paradise on it, but I just thought it was very tropical and very cute. And it has kind of like a V-neck in the top. And then um, a gathered waist, really big bell sleeves, which I actually kind of love. Um, and then, you know, the hem is a little shorter on the sides. I'm not 100% sure with this one. Oh, it has a little tie, a little tie in the front too. I'm not 100% sure with this, if this is actually gonna work as a dress for me or if it's gonna feel a little too short. But with a pair of leggings or capri leggings underneath it, I just think it's really cute. I love it. I'm just really into these bold prints and I just thought the, the fabric with the palm leaves and the um, birds of paradise, I just thought so cute. Um, okay, one more thing and then I will get to trying on, which is the fun part. Um, the, the last thing is a pair of sunglasses and these just kind of, I don't know, I, I'm looking at them and I can't really decide if they're gaudy or if I really like them. I don't know, but there was something about them that made me want to try them. They were $3.59 and honestly for that price, if I don't like them, I can donate them, donate them and I'm sure someone will will love them, but I think I might like them. Let me know what you think. They are very big. I think I kind of like them. Let me look in my big mirror. Yeah, they're kind of big, but I think I kind of like them. They've got like the gold accent and then the pink and green. And I don't know, pink and green is just kind of nostalgic. I feel like that was like an 80s color combination, which was, you know, when I was a teen and a, 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 a young adult. And so I feel like that, that color combination just kind of has a, um, nostalgic feel to me but anyway there's nothing you know it does have a little bit of a detail on the side but this not that exciting it's it's the fronts that are kind of interesting with the the pink the hot pink and the green and then the the gold on the sides but I think I do like them and I think I would wear them I think I might even wear them with the um with that little dress um Anyway, you probably noticed my hair. If you didn't watch my video, my little shorts yesterday, I did go and get my hair cut and colored. She really didn't cut much off. Um, apparently, my hair is getting healthier after not doing anything with it for the entire COVID time frame. Um, and she only had to cut a little off to keep it, you know, keep it healthy. So I'm really happy about that, that, that um, even with all the, the coloring I've done over the past probably six months. Um, my hair is actually in good shape, which is good. But anyway, I did this kind of hot pink and then the kind of turquoisey blue in the front. Um, with my hair, it doesn't hold color all that, that well. So it will lighten considerably once I wash it. I'm going to try to go, try to go maybe a few extra days without washing it and keep as much of the color as I can, but it'll start fading. And, um, unfortunately it doesn't hold it as long as I would like, but I do love it. I, I, it's just fun. It's fun. I, I don't know. I'm having fun just trying different things. Um, so anyway, just wanted to kind of explain why my, I, you know, that my hair is very different in this video than it has been in others. But anyway, I will be right back. I'm going to try some things on and we'll see how everything works. Okay. I'm back with the shorts. Let me step back and show you. Um, they fit. The waist is a little, it, it's very elastic -y, very stretchy. It's a little tight, but not uncomfortably tight. Um, I do like the pockets. I love pockets. Um, I thought I would grab a belt and just kind of see what I thought about it with my shirt tucked in and a belt because I think maybe I could dress this up a little. I just grabbed a t-shirt that I have on hand. Um, not sure if it's the best matching. I might be able to do better, but it, I just had it easy to grab. So that's what I did. Um, let's see. Let's see if we add a little bit of a belt. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, I think that just, I think I could definitely do that if I wanted to wear them a little, you know, dressier, maybe with a, a, a better shirt than this t-shirt, but I think it's cute. I also did put on the shoes. a little um I did put on the shoes I don't think they, they I think they match the shorts nicely but not so much the shirt um, but they fit 
so that's good but anyway um I think I think I like the shorts I have to say these shorts are definitely making me confront probably my last like body image feeling comfortable with my body um, as it is right in this moment these shorts are definitely making me confront my last one of my last hurdles if not the last one and that is my cellulite on my thighs I don't know why this is the hardest one for me to get past um but you know I'm gonna treat it like I've treated the rest of the hurdles and I am just going to fake it till I make it and I know that sounds trite and maybe silly but it has honestly worked for me so far I just feel like I tell myself you're gonna wear them I'm uncomfortable at first but the more I do it the more I get comfortable with it that's what I mean by faking it till I make it I'm um, gonna pretend I'm good with it until I'm really good with it um, so cellulite and all I'm gonna go out in my shorts and just be proud of this cellulite I have well I might not ever get that far but accept it it is a part of me and that's that's fine so anyway enough about my uh, personal body hang-ups um, let me go and try on. I think I'm gonna do the pajamas next because I really hope they fit. I think they're so fun. So let me try on the pajamas next and I will be right back. Okay, here we go. Um, they are the tiniest little bit long, um, but I'm used to that with pajamas unless they're gathered at the bottom. Since I'm only five feet tall, they're pretty much going to be a little bit long on me. I'm curious. Let me try on. Not that I'm, I, I, I really don't wear masks at night, but maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll take it on vacation and if the, the lights are too bright or something, you know, sometimes you get that room that's right next to something else, um, like the ice machine. Last time I went to the beach, we were in the room right next to the ice machine. Um, that's okay, yeah. It definitely does block everything out. Probably look ridiculous, but that's okay. Um, I just think it was kind of cute that it came with this. The material is super soft, super soft. Um, kind of stretchy, but super soft. And um, it is a little thin, so you know, I, you can definitely see through it a little bit, but it's pajamas, so that doesn't bother me. But I think it's really fun. The waist is very, very stretchy waist. It is a little, you know, I can feel it. It's not like somewhere I hardly even notice there's elastic. I can only really feel it a little, but not uncomfortable. So yeah, I think these are gonna be nice for, you know, I could wear them in the summer, but also going into the fall. And then if I get a little cool, even in the winter, I might wear these and wear the bottoms and just put a sweatshirt on with it or over it or something. But anyway, I wanted to show you the earrings with the shorts one uh, the smaller pair but totally forgot so I'll just show you both pairs with this dress so I'm gonna get this dress on and hope that it actually works as a dress on me if not I'm gonna have to go find a pair of leggings to put on with it but I will be right back and we will see okay I gotta say this one has me a little a little unsure okay so it has these strings here and they're actually like they pull a little bit um, and then it's elastic in the back so I can tie it in the front but I'm not sure that that really does anything for it I don't know that that really makes it look any better um, I think the sleeves are very fun the sleeves are very fun I do like the sleeves I'm not sure I really like this and I did take it off and look because I was like maybe this is supposed to be the back but the tag is in the is in the other side um, I think I could also flip this tie around and tie it in the back, but then I feel like it's not so flattering in the front. It just kind of goes, oh look, stomach. So I don't think I really like it that way either. I'm not sure I feel like this is really doing anything for the outfit, these strings. Like I said, I do like the, I love the sleeves. I love the print. It would definitely, you can see, need to be not a dress on me, definitely not a dress. I think the sizing is okay. I don't think, I think if it was any smaller, it might be too tight. Uh, 
I can always take the strings off. Okay. I'm really sorry if I keep looking in the big mirror. I'm trying to really figure out what I think about this. I'm wondering if I took a different belt and it, it wouldn't necessarily be this belt, but this is just the one I have handy. But what if I took a belt? Is, is that better? That's a little better. I think that actually is a little better. I don't know. What do you think? Does that make it better? I think a, a real belt instead of the strings, a wider belt instead of the strings. This one, I need to do something to make this. It doesn't seem to want to catch. There's nothing to like catch the belt and keep it from flipping back. But um, I do like that a little better. You know what I want to try? I wonder what it would look like if I flipped it and put the back in the front and the front in the back. I don't know. I'm going to try that. I'll be right back. I don't think this is necessarily any better. It's different. It's different. Um, I still do like the sleeves a lot. I, I think I would like it if it had the elastic all around. Um, I think the ruching, you know, the elastic here, um, I think if that went all the way around, I might like it better. I thought maybe with a long necklace, which we just got here. I thought maybe this way with like a long necklace, it might be cute. Maybe not quite that long, um, but honestly, I don't think it really works. I think it looks huge this way, um, and in the back, nah, I don't know. I don't know. I had such high hopes for this. I really did. I'm not doing well with the tropical dresses so far, but um, by the way, I did get this at Timu also. Isn't this cute? Um, it was li like less than two dollars, like most timu jewelry but i thought this was just very cute um so let me put that back on my little hanging thing okay i i don't know i i think this is a no even let me see if i can flip this around without pausing do my little uh soccer girl change that i used to do back in the day when i needed to change jerseys although to be perfectly honest back in the day when I needed to change my jersey I pretty much just had a sports bra on and just changed my shirt um okay anyway I, it's definitely I think better this way on the top it's just a little weird in the front I do love the sleeves though I really do love the sleeves I don't know I think I'm gonna have to think about this one Tell me what you think because I'm not sure if I'm trying to talk myself into liking it because I want to like it so much or if there's really something about it but I feel like there's just something that's holding me back and and I think it might be I don't know I don't know I need your help on this one definitely tell me what you think is it working is it not working do I just want it to work so bad that I'm, I'm seeing something that's not there? I think when it comes down to it, I have to ask myself, will I wear it? I'm almost afraid, I think probably I wouldn't. I think there's something about it that's making me feel a little uncomfortable. And maybe the sleeves are, I think the sleeves are beautiful, but maybe for my short arms, they're just a little too big too. I, I think it just, Maybe it's one of those things where it's it's beautiful. I do think it's beautiful. The fabric is nice, very soft. I love the print. I think it's great. It, maybe this is just one of those things that isn't really working on my body type, on, on me, because I'm short and, you know, and that's fine. There are some things that just aren't gonna work and that's okay. But I do wanna show you the rest of the accessories real quick before we finish up. So here's the sunglasses. I did show you before, but here's the sunglasses, you know, on, with something. I do think these are so cute. I, I will wear these with something for sure. And then I wanted to show you the earrings on. Um, so the first ones are these green leaves. They're almost like a metal, but with like a little bit of a coating to make them feel a little almost rubbery on the outside, but very solid like metal, but with a, a little bit of a coating. So let me, that's what they're gonna look like on. I like them, I think they're cute. I think they're very cute. Yeah, I will wear these. I like, every once in a while I really love a nice, 
big, funky, fun earrings. So I will wear those. But then I also have the times when I like something that maybe is a little bit more subtle. Um, you know, I just have different days and different, different things that I like. So for something a little more subtle, I think this one is, is very pretty. So let me just, I'm just going to put the one on because I don't know what happened to the back of the second one. But that's, that's these. Those are very pretty. I think these are gorgeous. I, I really, I really like them. Okay. So, oh, I really do. Okay. Anyway, wrapping it up. <laughs> um, this one's kind of a mixed bag. I love the pajamas. The shorts are great. I'm going to, I will definitely wear the shorts. I think they're super cute especially for the beach they'd be great to throw on over a bathing suit at the beach as well and maybe go somewhere to have lunch or something um this i'm afraid it's a no i think in my in, in in my you know deep in the pit of my stomach i'm feeling like it's a no i want it to be a yes i just don't i think i probably wouldn't wear it because i think it's just a little much but the accessories are all great so you know all in all i think i did pretty good if i'm only returning one thing. I'm still on my quest to find a, a leafy tropical dress. It might not be this summer. It might be next summer, but I'm going to keep looking until I find one. Um, so still looking. Anyway, thanks for being here with me. I really appreciate it. I hope that you have a wonderful day. And I also hope that you will remember that it's never too late. It's never too late to try something new, to do something kind of wacky and crazy. Um, cause you never know. You never know if you'll like it. You never know how much fun it might be. So if there's something out there, you thought I really want to try it. Maybe it's time. Maybe it's time to put aside fear of what others might think, fear of what people might say and just go for it. Um, that's what I'm trying to do in my life, trying to be brave. And um, I'm not talking about doing anything that's dangerous or risky or anything like that. But I'm talking about things that, you know, maybe a class you wanted to take, but you, you know, thought it was too late to do it or whatever. Anything that you wanted to try that's safe. <laughs> uh, but anyway, there's no better time than now. So, on that note, I am going to leave. Bye, everybody, and I will see you next time.